Ooh. Hello, I'm Ooh. Scott. <laughs> and I'm Oscar. And together we are the Gymfluencers UK in the forest. Now the gin we're trying today is Tapper's Falling Leaves Spiced ah, Autumn Gin. There you go. Yes, the there. Tapper's <laughs> Distillery is on the Wirral Peninsula near the historic cities of Chester and Liverpool. There you go, all the way so, up there. Falling Leaves Gin is Tapper's autumn Ooh. seasonal expression made with hetero harvest of botanicals. The key botanicals include bilberries, blackberry leaves, rose hips, elderberries, fennel seeds, along with the usual gin botanicals. What? And no expense was spared with, that, with our, um, our special effects here. There you go, 3D. It comes in a 50 centiliter bottle with an ABV of 39.8% and costs around 25 pounds. That's really reasonable, but at the moment we've got um, a fire going on in our uh, room because uh, someone, someone threw <laughs> these non-flammable, these non-flammable leaves onto our candle. Onto our candle. So there we go. So what we'll do is we'll just scroll back because we don't want to miss anything. So <laughs> sorry about that. There you go. Luckily, yeah, there we go. That's fine. So the perfect serve they suggest with oh. an aromatic tonic um, and Whew. blackberries. But we're going to try it neat first because aromatic is a little bit strong for us. So we want to decide how it tastes. Um, and luckily we didn't have to call the fire brigade because um, I spotted it and it nearly went out. Could you not hear the roaring fire next to you? It's like, wow. Right, okay. Anywho, Anywho. back with the video. Back with the video. Oh, I need to go offline. Oh, look. Oh, if only. I say offline. Um, I can, wow, I can really sm smell. <laughs> Anyhow, let's do this. Let's um, open it yeah, up. All, all like we went out and picked these. <laughs> I Is that did. The best you can do. I picked them from Amazon, not the rainforest, <laughs> the actual <laughs> shop. There we go. All right, let's have a look. There you are. are the what? You can't even throw leaves. <sighs> you have no purpose. Right. There Come we on. Go. All right. This is taking longer than picking all these leaves. Or putting the fire out that we had. Right. There we right. go. Hello? What? Oscar? What happened Oh, we're there? moving, we're moving. Uh, do you know what, it's probably an earthquake. Did he just, did he just hit the camera? Oh. Right, okay. So... Oops, hold on, this is going so wrong, this video. Oh. Oh, hello. <laughs> Right, <laughs> so firstly, there is a tinge to it. Well, it's There's not more of a tinge, tinge. there's a real colour. Tinge. It's very autumnal in colour. In fact, it is not too dissimilar. Well, that's miles away. Anywho. Well, I'm just looking at your face. It's very unusual. <gasps> <laughs> it feels a bit hot. It reminds okay. it reminds me slightly of. Um, it's it's like a it's like a fortified spirit. Yes. Like a fort, It's like a fortified wine. Um, it has elements of and the smell. The smells lovely. That's a really familiar. It's yeah. like it's like, and I can't pick out which flavour it is. Like Jolly Ranchers. Or a, no, like a boiled sweet. I'm so old. Like a boiled sweet that was fruit flavoured ones. And the leaves are falling. Um, yeah, no, it's um, oh, and the leaves are falling. Oh, well done. Um, as, there that, you go. as he says that, it's an unusual taste. It is. It has elements to me of kind of like a slow gin, but only only slightly, not not very slow. Yeah, it's, it's it's almost it's like a rested gin. It tastes it like a rested gin. It is definitely more like a rested gin. Yeah, that's what um, it tastes like. Hold on, this is... So I wonder if we do put it with an aromatic. Because they're It's very aromatic. sharp on the, like, on the first taste of it. Really sharp. Finishes off slightly sweeter. Mm. It's puzzling me. So um, we're going to have our break so we can do a montage. And in that break, we're going to make sure the fire's out. And then we're also going... <laughs> We're also going to determine how we're going to drink it. Yeah. So stay tuned to see how we drink it.
Hi. And welcome back. We've managed to find an ice bucket in the in forest. In the forest, as you do. Um, cheers. I'm glad it was just the ice we bucket. We extinguished the, uh, the forest fire. Thanks. Anyway, right, we cheers. did. We, cheers. We did decide to put an aromatic tonic with it. That's actually nice. Uh, not for me. Not for you. I need to stir it. Oh. We need to stir it. We found a stirrer in the um, in, the, in the, forest. the forest. It's a twig. It's a twig, not twink. A twig. Yeah, it's definitely not one for me. You don't like it? Why don't you like it? I don't know. That is actually like, you know how I don't like... Um... The bloody Shiraz. Yeah. That has elements of it for me. It has elements of bloody Shiraz for me. I, yeah. Uh, let's just see, uh, pass this over to our special guest, who we, someone we just met in the forest, as you do, because you actually do. Uh, we're out walking our dog. Yeah, all right. <laughs> <laughs> I, mean, well, I haven't got a dog, but I'm out walking the dog. Um, do you, I mean... Just picking up the leaves. Oh, <laughs> and the set. <laughs> what do you think of it? Um, we're getting... It's very bitter for me. Oh, I guess, I guess kind of sweet warming elements. I do, I do get... It does taste to me slightly like the bloody Shiraz from um, Four Pillars. Which Scott loves, and I, I, love. I really don't yeah. like. I can't, I can't drink the stuff, um, but I do like other Four Pillars stuff, which is weird. I could see why they would say it's autumnal, because it is a bit like a, you know, when you're at the, the Harvest Festival, it is a bit like that they've picked, you know, the stuff in there is kind of like rich berries that are slightly going, going over. Because we always have harvest festivals in Islington. No. Well, we did, yeah, we did at school. We had a harvest festival at school every year. Yeah, I don't think we did. I don't know, did we? You did, you did. When you all brought food in and they all distributed it to the poor. Remember, I, I was brought up in the 70s. We couldn't afford to bring food in. Oh, you did. You just had it delivered to you. Um, but... Do you like it or...? So we're getting bitter elements I'll, from, I'll from, our, from our um, uh, just special in that guest. Position. I'll be there in a minute. Uh, <laughs> uh, it's not that kind of forest. Um, no, I really can't drink that. It's a shame. That's me. I remember, I don't like um, the bloody Shirazes. Right, so um, I, need to, I need to explain what it tastes like. So I am getting kind of like um, a bit of jamminess from it. Um, jammy, kind of sticky berry. It's quite earthy. Um, but then for me, it towels off. It towels off sweet. Um, I do get an earthiness from it. Um, but yeah, re it's so reminiscent of that. If you've ever tried the bloody Shiraz gin, it's quite reminiscent of that. I wouldn't. I wouldn't say it's something I drink all of the time. Um, I wouldn't turn it away if if I got bought it in the pub. Um, I would. I think it's. <laughs> I think it's rather interesting. Right? Should we score it then? See? I'm really, really disappointed. But anyhow. Because it took us ages to pick all these leaves, actually to unpack them. And then some idiot to throw them nearly burnt On the forest fire. Down. On the fire. Right. Okay. Right, I'm ready. I'm happy to score it. I, I don't know if I'm being too harsh. Anyway, oh, I'm going for it. Yeah, there you go. Um... I, I can't drink this. I don't like this. That doesn't mean it's a bad gin. So why have you scored it three then? I was going to do a two, but I think there's some effort gone into it. There's a lot of effort gone into I do, it. And that's the thing is there is some effort gone into it. Um, and like the, the bloody Shiraz, and I keep on going back to that because that's the only one I can really compare it to. And a, and a really bad Negroni. Like there's, there's few and far between, uh, you know, very few uh, Negronis I can actually drink. Um, that's me. You may be different. The thing is, we tried their um, Christmas one, the figure you put in, you, you like that. Yeah, so and, I'm gonna go up you... to three, because I know these aren't, I don't I don't think they're idiots. I just think this isn't my. This isn't your taste. This isn't my taste, because we, we have had some of their stuff and I have liked we it. We liked the one they did with um, the chef, um, which was the rose one. Do you remember? We did the rose one. 
Simon Rimmer. Yeah. <laughs> I keep on doing you that. Keep on doing that. It's like that, now you've upset all the wildlife. Shh, That's it. Calm down. Um, the bears have come out of hibernation. Got one here. Um, yeah. No. <laughs> It's, it's, yeah, it's, I, it's I, not, I, I, I can't remember. Um, can't I'm just, remember. I'm just more, um, you know, I'm, I'm just trying to calculate in my head that I'm not being unfair on this lot. It's definitely for me. It's definitely a gin I can't drink. I would never order this. I don't mind. I it. couldn't drink it. If you got it for me, I'd give it to him. I'll that doesn't it. mean it's a bad gin. I do like this company. We've had some of their stuff that I do like. I keep on repeating myself, but just trying to get across. I think they're talented. It's just not gin for me at all in any sense of your words. Um, and I definitely wouldn't buy it. I liked it. He likes it. I liked it. It's it's seven from me. Anything, five is mediocre. Anything above a five is good. Um, yeah, I would drink it. I'd, I'd happily drink it. If someone bought me a bottle of that, I'd be happy with a bottle of that. Um, the it's... only thing I will say is, can you sort out your labels? We've, all of our labels seem to be coming off around the edges. Or maybe it's designed like that way because it's like falling leaves. Who oh, can okay. tell? Okay, well, because th that's just, yeah, I just want that back on. Oh, Send me some glue. Right, some glue. I'll do, I'll do it. That's right, do your bits. Um, don't forget to like and subscribe. Do that. Drop us a comment if you had that, if you would disagree with me. I like that. Um, and we'll see you next video. See you later. Cheers. Bye.